From the Library of Maria Menounos, this is Book Circle Online, featuring in-depth discussion, insight, news, and commentary on all the world's leading book titles and their authors. And now, Book Circle Online. Hey guys, it's Book Circle Online. We're here with Paige McKenzie, the haunted sunshine girl herself. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. Yeah, of course. Um, congratulations on everything. Thank you. Yeah, it's a lot. It's like uncharted territory. It is a little bit. It's exciting though. Yeah, it's totally. Good. Yeah, so you, <laughs> it is good. It's good. Um, you've been doing this series since 2010. Yeah. When did you find out that the Weinstein Company was interested in making into the book series and then movie? Yeah. About a year, and it's now moved to television, not movie. Oh, yeah. really? Oh, inside scoop. There. Oh, my word. Yeah. Three wow. books and a TV show. Did you know three books? Did you know that? I did. Okay. Well, there yeah. you go. So nothing new there. Oh, my God. Why did you guys change it to TV? I think that we're excited about TV. Well, not that we're not excited about the movie. Yeah, yeah. But TV would be, I think, an, a, just an easier transition. Totally. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's it would like. I know right out of the gate you've had a lot of viewers and it was like growing over yeah. time. What was <laughs> what was like the big moment, like the tipping point where you were like, wow, this is a this is a big deal? So the first five million views on the channel are all organic, which means it's not my grandma watching or my neighbors or my cousins or whatever. Yeah. It's complete strangers that I don't know. Five so million. First five million. And then we started to tell people. We're like, oh hey, I have this cool thing. You should check it out. Really? Yeah. And I mean, there are a couple like realizations in that, that you yeah. were an actress. Yes. And then on top of that, that this was like a pre-planned, thought out thing. Mm -hmm. I think that's pretty amazing. Yes. And there was the whole, everybody was like, wait, this isn't real? I thought this was real. I thought you were really haunted. So that was kind of, that still happens to this day. There are still a couple people yeah. that watch the beginning and then be like, Oh, it's not real. Oh, okay, I got it. So we had we had a couple people we were really angry about that, but then they came back. Oh, so. were they angry? Yes, they're like, you tricked me. I'm like, I never said anything about oh, if it was no. real or not real. So it's fine. It worked out. But, okay. Yeah. And then you guys picked it specifically for like the ghost aspect, right? The paranormal. Yes. So when we were doing research, the number two search thing on YouTube was ghost. Really? Under Little Wayne. Little Wayne was number <laughs> one. Couldn't do a whole channel so you, on that. You couldn't get Little Wayne. This Wayne. wouldn't be nearly as an infinite interesting interview right now. <laughs> little Wayne was booked. <laughs> yes. So I was like, okay. So we decided on Ghost. Wow. Yeah. So it was strategic. Yeah, that's really smart. And then buy like the vehicle of like a young, cute girl. Yeah. Okay. Me. <laughs> Putting yeah. you out there. Cute. Yeah, exactly. And then that's not even your house, right? No. No, no it's not. That's amazing. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And then, so <laughs> um, <laughs> even though it's like fake, yeah. Per se. Um, it's like the character Sunshine is very much you. Yeah. I used to say that I was 98.9% Sunshine. Okay. Um, I've, I had to lower my expectations. Sunshine is getting, I think, cooler and more amazing. And I've kind of plateaued. I'm, I'm like, this is this is how awesome I am. This is my life. So we're like 89%. 89%. Similar. Yeah. Uh, so I'm, what makes up that like 11% difference? Yeah. Uh, she's definitely more positive than I am. Yes, yeah. I'm a little bit of like, nah, no, I think you're okay. wrong. And sometimes like, yeah, it'll all work out. Uh, she's braver than I am, definitely. Okay. She, I would never. If there's somebody, something in your house, you would move. So yeah. I'm trying, it's like, no, this is going to happen. I'm going to get to the bottom of this. Oh, fascinating. Yeah. And did I read too that you said you have like social anxiety? I, <laughs> yes, I do. Yes, that is very true. I, I guess I'm curious how you're able to have this like human conversation right now. Uh, it, you would be surprised. This is actually very difficult. But I, I, <laughs> this is like not a joke. This is totally real. I have some, yes, some social anxiety. Uh, it is, it manifests itself in things like going to the grocery store. Can't do that alone. Uh, it sounds made up, but it's real, I swear. Uh, but it is something I just kind of put on. You know how people like say that they have to have a mask if they do things, like something that they have, a talisman yeah, or whatever? Yeah, totally. Mine, this is, this is like, it's not an act, but it's like, this is, this is Paige. Professional Paige now. Do, 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 do. So right now it's your mask? Yeah. Okay. It's, it is a degree of myself. Of, of course. It's not like I'm being fake. Yeah, yeah, this yeah. This is definitely still me, but it is like, me at home without pants is more me than me here Right now. When it's appropriate, you know how to turn it on. Yes. For interviews. And wear pants. <laughs> and wear pants. Yeah. It's a dress. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> in the book, you, uh, this not you, the character Sunshine yes. loves Jane Austen. Yes. Is that a part of you? Yes. I'm okay. obsessed with Pride and Prejudice. Really? It is my favorite movie. It's a good book, too. But it's my favorite movie, the Keira Knightley version. The Keira Knightley. Okay. By the way, Matthew McFadden, Keira Knightley. It's the best one. Uh, watch the director's commentary. It's amazing. 
Joe Wright gives you a little insight on some swans, which is great too. So. Swans? Uh, yeah, there's five swans. It's a, it's a bit of a story. Anyways, but one of them has its head underwater. That's supposed to be Kitty. If you know who that is, it's really funny. Okay. Anyway. So not the Emma Thompson version? No. Yeah, no. Okay. Yeah. It's like my biggest like shame in life that I've not read any Jane Austen. That's okay. Yeah, it's a little, it'll be our secret. We won't okay. We well, won't post this yeah. video. <laughs> Just <Sorry>. kidding. <laughs> um, I think in the book, more than the series, for me, I like, got a better sense of your relationship with your mom. From uh, the book or from yeah, the series? Yeah, um, from the book. I thought it was really a lot, uh, it was clear for me, which was exciting, yeah. like how well the character Sunshine got along with her. Mm -hmm. Is that very much what it's like for you guys? Yeah, that is another very true, a lot, most of it, we call it just fictional reality because okay. it is, that this is our relationship, this is kind of, I mean, what I'm doing right now is kind of what I do all the time. I'm kind of this weird constantly. Uh, but no, me and my mom are that close. Wow. Uh, actually, probably closer than in the book. Uh, the, I think the series is a little more to oh, what, really? yeah, to how, how we are. Uh, we just, well, we finished their sentences. It's weird. We're like an old married couple. It's very hard. Yeah. yeah. And I know that you have other siblings in real life. I do. Are they as close as well? Yes. We are oh, all very cool. close. Uh, we're kind of a weird family. If you, it's nice. Can, it is uh, typical. Typical teen stuff didn't really happen to us. Yeah. Oh, we weird. and we kind of avoided that. We don't, I, like. I don't. I don't know if I ever went through that like weird dramatic phase. Of being like, I hate my parents. I guess we should ask your mom. Yeah, my mom would be like, no, she probably didn't. I, yeah. Wow. Yeah. I, I like too that because the character is adopted. I know. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Spoiler. Um, I mean, a lot of like classic stories, that's like a big aspect because mm -hmm. it's a big deal. But it's like all about searching for the family and why that happened, and hopefully they're rich. Yeah, and, exactly, <laughs> Annie. <laughs> yeah, um, and hopefully there's a crown and the royalty. Yeah. Um, I like that for Sunshine. Like she loved her mom, and like mm -hmm. it was totally cool. And yeah. At least for now, mm -hmm. she didn't need to find more. Yeah, yeah. That got put into the book because we don't look enough alike in real life. Oh really? Me and my mother don't look anything alike. I look much more like my father. Uh, my mom has red hair. Yeah. And she's freckled and. I'm not. So in the web series, it doesn't talk about adoption. No, in the web series, it doesn't come up. We just say we are, and people wrote in all the time, like you couldn't find actors that look more alike. We're like, she actually birthed me. Like this is, <laughs> I really did. This is all real, guys. Oh my god. Yeah. So. I guess that's possible. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if you don't look like your mom, you don't heard worry. it here first. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Don't worry. You may not be adopted. So. <laughs> um, okay. So tell me this. Um, the character's name is Sunshine. Yes. Um, a little more spoilerly than that, um, I think because it mentions the web series, we can say the like Lucy. Mm -hmm. am, am I saying Lucy? That was Lucich. right. Good job. Yes. Must have watched up on that. <laughs> um, she's a member of this Asian race. Oh, ancient. I meant to say ancient. Yes, I was like Asian. I don't know where that came from. It's Celtic. She's adopted. We don't know. Yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> sorry, ancient race. Um, in the Celtic, it means brighter. Light, light bringer. Light yeah. bringer. All of those were correct, but Thank yes. you, fantastic. Yeah. Um, which correlates so well with Sunshine. With Sunshine. So was that the plan from the beginning, or how did that end up? Um, it was kind of, I mean, like I said, everything was a little bit strategic. We yeah. We thought this out. I have two producing partners, Nick Hagen, and then my mother, Mercedes Rose. And we thought about this. Like I said, we researched, and we figured it out. And the Lucich thing is something that we made up, and it's, I mean, it was all very planned. Wow. Yeah. I guess I'm surprised because it happened so far down the road. Yeah, yes. And I was 16 at the time, which is very, people are like, you worked with your mom at 16? Like, what is wrong with you? You had a job that wasn't, you know, working at Forever 21 or McDonald's. Uh, right. And like, I was not, a lifeguard. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So like, that sounds awesome. But Wow. Yeah. How many videos were you planning on doing? We didn't have a plan. We just started with five. We put them up. And like I said, all organic. And just kind of like wow. saw what happened. The big surprise was the role model thing, where everyone was like, "You're my, you're my hero," and I did not expect that. Oh. I was shocked. I was like, "You look up to me. That is so." I mean, I, I'm a dork. Like, I I say dumb things all the time in interviews. Like, I, <laughs> I said something about not wearing pants a minute ago. That maybe should not go in. But anyways, I said it again, so now it has <laughs> to go in. But yeah, I just thought it was very odd. But I guess that it is kind of an underrated. Demographic. There's not a lot of girls you can look up to right now that are kind of quirky and dorky. And and if you're cool and popular and, and that's what you want to do, then you have the Kardashians or yeah. or, or that, that group. But there isn't anything kind of dorky and accessible. Because Jennifer Lawrence is dorky, but she's not necessarily accessible. She's not on any 
social platforms. Oh, yeah. I'm on all of them. So, <laughs> yeah. I guess, too, like, dorky, but, like, but obviously very strong yeah. and, like, able to save the day. Definitely, yes. A little buffy. A little, yeah. I can kick some butt. Yeah, I liked your, um, it was in the back of the book, like, Gilmer Girls meets Buffy. Yeah. That's yeah. great. Her yeah. activity, we kind of, all of those go into it. Yeah. yeah. Also, like, Jennifer Lawrence is in Hunger Games, and it's a strong character, but it's yeah. not, like, of this world. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it is. It is a, a made-up fictional, non-fictional place, a fictional yeah. place. And Sunshine lives in Washington, which is a real place. And, <laughs> yeah, it's exciting. Now that you are being viewed as, like, a role model, does that... So strange. Yeah. <laughs> is it? <laughs> It is. It is weird. It's very hot. Now, I mean, it's been almost five years, so mm -hmm. it's, it's a little different now. In the beginning, it was like, are you sure? Like, come on, really? But no, it's good. And, and now it's so, such a large part of it is I have to like subconsciously think about it. Like, would Sunshiners like this? Would they think this is dumb? And it, it is like pressure, but it's good pressure. It's good. Yeah. I think it's so cool to have like this other, like you were saying before, like you are like socially like scared of the grocery store. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Those sale items are so scary. <laughs> um, <laughs> He's making fun of me, but it's real. No, um, I guess it's like fun to have like this part of your life where you can like mm -hmm. stretch yourself and like have yeah. these like fun experiences. It is. It's really fun, and it is. Like I said, it is like a mask, but it's not. Yeah. Not in a fake way. It's, no. It's still me, but it is like, if, if you wanted to meet the real me, I'd be really boring and probably like. I don't know, not very fun. So. It's like fun to turn on your personality. Yeah, it is. It's fun to be like, switch. <laughs> <laughs> um, and I guess this like alternate part of your life, yeah. you're just, just only child with your mom. Mm -hmm. Are your brother and sister like, are they like anxious? Do they want in on the action? Uh, it's really funny. They're really, like I said, we're really close. Yeah. And uh, my brother is actually the one that wanted to be the writer. He's a couple years older than me. And uh, I felt like I kind of stole his thunder, and I felt like a total meanie pants. Oh, no. But uh, he's really very forgiving, and he's amazing. I love my siblings a ton. I can't even, like, I can't even really talk about it because it's so, I love them so much. Uh, so they, yeah, they kind of just like, this is what she needs to do right now. This is, That's awesome. This is her time. Yeah, they're amazing. I love you guys. Oh, cool. So. And then in the book trailer, we saw a lot, all of the same actors playing a lot of the roles. Yeah. Are they going to be in the TV series? Nothing that I can talk about right now. Okay. Yeah. What, what stage of the planning process is it? It's we, very pre production. It's very pre production, yeah. Very pre. So, yeah. There's not, I mean, there's not a lot of not telling you. It's just a lot of like. Up in the air. Yeah. It's exciting, but it's definitely. Totally. Yeah. Okay, well, then tell me this. Um, book two. Yes. What can we look forward to happen with a Nolan? Ooh, Nolan. Uh, for starters, book two definitely. Book one followed the web series very closely. Yeah, I did. As you know. While still bringing some like cool new things. Yes, exactly. Yeah. It dulged more into the school life and all that because I couldn't really take a camera to school because uh, it would be weird. Uh, yeah. And book two completely veers away from that. And it is totally new stuff for everyone. So that'll be exciting. Uh, Nolan is definitely in it. Okay. Yeah. In like the love interest thing. Um, I'm <laughs> you not, wanna kiss him? Yeah, I'm not, I don't know about that. Um you'll have to read it. Okay. Yeah. I guess I'm like anticipating drama because it's sacrifice of sunshine. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Oh my god, what's gonna yeah. happen? I don't, I don't know. know. Oh I'm so nervous. Let me just say that there might be some more exciting characters too. Not that Nolan is not exciting, that's not what I mean. Other exciting characters. What mm -hmm. Paige is saying is a love triangle. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know about that. No, I don't uh, Maybe. I, it yeah. has to happen. <laughs> yeah. In order to be successful, you need a love triangle. Really? Has Twilight taught you nothing? Mm. Harry Potter didn't have one. Yeah, you go ahead. Like, fake it. Seven books later. It's doing just Him and his, like, wand. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Okay, too much. <laughs> cool. That's a lot of exciting things coming up that you're still working yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Um, where can everyone find you on, like, social media and the internet? Everything. You have my everything. everything. I'm on YouTube, uh, Tumblr, Facebook. Most of them are Haunted Sunshine. If you want to find me on Snapchat, it's official HSG. It's the only one I couldn't get Haunted Sunshine to. Okay, I was great. a little late to the game. Obviously. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, Snapchat. Darn it. I know. <laughs> and um, I tweet from Jeff Masters one and as Woo. always, you can find all of our content on iTunes, on YouTube, and of course, bookcircleonline.com. Thanks. Bye, everyone. Like, I know right out of the gate, you've had a lot of viewers and it was like growing over time. Yeah. What was, <laughs> what was like the big moment, like the tipping point where you were like, wow, this is a, this is a big deal. 
So the first five million views on the channel are all organic, which means it's not my grandma watching or my neighbors or my cousins or whatever. Yeah. It's complete strangers that I don't know. Five so million. First five million. And then we started to tell people. We are like, oh, hey, I have this cool thing. You should check it out. Really? Yeah. And I mean, there are a couple like realizations in that, that you yeah. were an actress. Yes. And then on top of that, that this was like a pre-planned, thought-out thing. Mm -hmm. I think that's pretty amazing. Yes, and there was the whole, everybody was like, wait, this isn't real? I thought this was real. I thought you were really haunted. So that was kind of, that still happens to this day. There are still a couple people yeah. that watch the beginning and then be like, oh, it's not real. Oh, okay, I got it. So we had, we had a couple people be really angry about that, but then they came back. Oh, so. were they angry? Yes, they're like, you tricked me. I'm like, I never said anything about oh, if it was no. real or not real. So it's fine, it worked out. But okay, yeah. and then you guys picked it specifically for like the ghost aspect, right? The paranormal. Yes, so when we were doing- Of course. It's not like I'm being fake. Yeah, yeah, this yeah. This is definitely still me, but it is like, me at home without pants is more me than me here Right now. When it's appropriate, you know how to turn it on. Yes. For interviews. And wear pants. <laughs> and wear pants. Yeah. It's a dress. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> in the book, you, uh, this, not you, the character Sunshine yes. loves Jane Austen. Yes. Is that a part of you? Yes. I'm right. obsessed with Pride and Prejudice. Really? It is my favorite movie. It's a good book, too. But it's my favorite movie, the Keira Knightley version. The Keira Knightley, okay. By the way, Matthew McFadden, Keira Knightley. It's the best one. Uh, watch the director's commentary. It's amazing. Joe Wright gives you a little insight on some swans, which is great too. So. Swans? Uh, yeah, there's five swans. It's a, it's a bit of a story. Anyways, but one of them has its head underwater, and that's supposed to be Kitty. If you know who that is, it's really funny. Okay. Anyway. So not the Emma Thompson version? No. Yeah, no. Okay. Yeah. It's like my biggest like shame in life, but I've not read any Jane Austen. That's okay. <laughs> it's a little, it'll be our secret. We won't okay. Anything. We won't post this yeah. video. <laughs> Just Sorry. <kidding. laughs> um, I think in the book, more than the series, for me, I like got a better sense of your relationship with your mom. From uh, the book or from yeah, the series? Yeah, um, from the book. I nah. <laughs> no, I think you're okay. wrong. And sometimes like, yeah, it'll all work out. Uh, she's braver than I am, definitely. Okay. She, I would never. If there's somebody, something in your house, you would move. Sunshine yeah. is like, no, this is gonna happen. I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. Oh, fascinating. Yeah. And did I read too that you said you have like social anxiety? I, <laughs> yes, I do. Yes, that is very true. I, I guess I'm curious how you're able to have this like human conversation right now. Uh, it, you would be surprised. This is actually very difficult, but I, I, <laughs> this is like not a joke. This is totally real. I have some, yes, some social anxiety. Uh, it is, it manifests itself in things like going to the grocery store. Can't do that alone. Uh, it sounds made up, but it's real, I swear. Uh, but it is something I just kind of put on. You know how people like say that they have to have a mask if they do things, like something that they have, a talisman yeah, or whatever? Yeah, totally. Mine, this is, this is like, it's not an act, but it's like, this is, this is Paige. Professional Paige now. Do, 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 do. So right now it's your mask? Yeah. Okay. It's, it is a degree of myself. Oh, oh. In research, the number two search thing on YouTube was ghost. Really? Under Lil Wayne. Lil Wayne was number one. <laughs> couldn't do a whole channel so on that. You couldn't get Lil this Wayne. This wouldn't be nearly as an interesting interview right now. <laughs> Lil Wayne was booked. <laughs> yes. So I was like, okay. So we decided on ghost. Wow. Yeah. So it was strategic. Yeah, that's really smart. And then buy like the vehicle of like a young, cute girl. Yeah. Okay. Me. <laughs> Putting yeah. you out there. Cute. Yeah, exactly. And then that's not even your house, right? No. No, no, it's not. That's amazing. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And then so. <laughs> um, even though it's like fake, yeah. per se, um, it's like the character Sunshine is very much you. Yeah, I used to say that I was 98.9% .9 Sunshine. Okay. Um, I've, I had to lower my expectations. Sunshine is getting, I think, cooler and more amazing, and I've kind of plateaued. I'm, I'm like, this is, this is how awesome I am. This is my life. So we're like 89%. 89? Similar, yeah. Uh, so I'm, what makes up that like 11% difference? Yeah, uh, she's definitely more positive than I am. Yes, yeah. I'm a little bit of like... From the library of Maria Menounos, this is Book Circle Online, featuring in-depth discussion, insight, news, and commentary on all the world's leading book titles and their authors. And now, Book Circle Online. Hey guys, it's Book Circle Online. We're here with Paige McKenzie, the haunted sunshine girl herself. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having yeah, me. Yeah, of course. Um, congratulations on everything. Thank you. Yeah, it's a lot. It's like uncharted territory. It is a little bit. It's exciting though. Yeah, it's totally. Good. Yeah, so you, <laughs> it is good. It's good. Um, you've been doing this series since 2010. Yeah. When did you find out that the Weinstein Company was interested in making into the book series and then movie? Yeah. 
about a year, and it's now moved to television, not movie. Oh, yeah, really? Inside scoop there. Oh, my word. Yeah, three wow. books and a TV show. Did you know three books? Did you know that? I did. Okay, well, there yeah. you go. So nothing new there. Oh, my God. See, why did you guys change it to TV? I think that we're excited about TV. Well, not that we're not excited about the movie. Yeah, yeah. But TV would be, I think, an, a, just an easier transition. Totally. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's, it, 